All right, we ended the last video talking about the resistors and different ranges. And so now we're going to actually pick our resistors. And before we do that, we're just going to go back to our app on the kinds of resistors. So if you're looking for real resistors, then the real resistor will actually have these bands on them. So make sure you go ahead and make sure you go ahead and get them if you're looking for the real resistor. And we want a, um, the other resistor that we want to look at will be a 1500 ohm resistor. So it should look like this, should have these kinds of bands, brown, green, and red band. And if we want a 2200 ohm resistor, let's just go ahead and it should be red, red, and red, 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 red. Okay. And with a 5% tolerance there, it's gold. So let's go ahead and plug these in mm -hmm. and let's just choose some resistor values and I'm going to choose something like 1001 and you know something along those lines or what was it as long as we're falling within our ranges we'll, we'll be fine as long as we fall within those ranges just going to the class right now. Shouldn't take long at all. So we're in the night Friday hybrid. Just go ahead and go all the way down to the bottom here. Go to resistors. So we're on question two right now. I'm going to go ahead and just choose some things. So as long as we're within our boundaries here, we should be fine. And the first boundary is going to be between 1050 and 950. So we can pick 1025 ohms for the first one. And then we can pick, I believe, no, nope, we can't pick 1600, but we can pick uh, 1499. We should be able to do better than that. We can pick 1400, I believe. So let me see if that's in our range. Uh, 1425, nope, 1400 will not work. But I can do 1450. And then for 2200, we can do uh, 2300 should be fine. So I'm just going to pick 2300 and let's see if that works. Okay, so I can always go to my next one and that'll be it for that particular problem.